out there is 40 and 50 plus and looking for foxy fashion looks for the holiday season, I've got you covered. I know what it's like to be at that age, that phase of life, and you wanna look good, you wanna look hot, you don't wanna look like you're trying to look like Britney Spears back when she was in her 20s. On the other hand, you don't wanna look like Barbara Bush. I've got you covered. I've got some really cool looks that I have been absolutely loving, and this is my first take on a fashion video. So let's get to it, and you guys tell me how I did. Okay, you guys know the drill. Make sure you're subscribed to this channel and make sure you hit that cute little bell so that you're notified whenever, whenever I put up a new video on this channel. Everybody, Kelly Alexa here, serial entrepreneur, fitness fanatic, recently keto convert, and now I'm a fashion expert. No, I'm not a fashion expert. I just am somebody who loves fashion. And because of my whole experience being a keto convert, and losing a sick amount of weight and feeling good in my skin again. Honestly, I have been having more fun with fashion again at age 52 than I have been in probably the past decade. Honest to God, I mean, I, I have been able to wear clothes in my closet that I haven't been able to wear in the past five years. So that's been, amazing but it's also been awesome to buy clothes um, hot clothes new brands hot dresses and just feel good and i mean honestly you guys like i feel better in clothes than i did i feel better at 52 than i did at 22 and that's amazing so i'm excited to share with you some of these looks and in fact um, I'm just going to go ahead and, and dive right in um, and tell you about this top that I'm wearing right now because this is going to be the first outfit um, and what I'm going to do with each outfit is kind of do a close-up and, and give you a close-up and then I'm going to back up, we're going to change camera views um, so that you can see a little bit more. Um, I am <laughs> shooting this video as you can see in my bathroom. Now in the future I do plan to do more fashion videos. I'm putting together a whole like little mini studio in one of our upstairs bedrooms so that'll have a full-length mirror and we'll be able to shoot a lot better so bear with me on this first one. This was um, not really what I planned to do today but I just decided what the heck. I got some new dresses delivered today and I decided to just go for it. But anyway, um, this first outfit that I'm going to show you, the top that I'm wearing is from Boston Proper. Now, some of you guys that have been following me on Instagram will know, not only have I been a customer of Boston Proper for probably, I'm going to say close to 15 years. I have been buying from them for a long, long time. And full disclosure right now, they are a client of mine, so I am working with them. Um, and this is a fantastic blouse that I'm wearing from them. I don't know if you can see, but this is kind of like a blue um, snakeskin pattern. It is hot. Um, very, very comfortable. One of the things that they're known for, I would say one of the things that they're known for and that their customers love them for the most are their tops. They have very, very sexy tops for women and also fantastic dresses. I have dresses, I'm just looking in my closet right now. I have dresses from Boston Proper that I've bought over the past 10 years and every single time I wear a dress from them, I get stopped wherever we go and, and women just are like, oh my God, where'd you get that dress? Um, some are Boston Proper brands, some will be a brand that, are, that, it, that they carry from somebody somewhere else or another designer, but you, you've got to check them out. Again, they definitely are serving that 40 plus female. Absolutely love their stuff. I literally think I ordered their entire catalog this December. It's getting to be a little bit of a problem. I don't think it's a problem, but anyway, Stay tuned, I'm gonna show you the rest of this outfit. Now, come on, who wouldn't wanna wear this top for the holidays, am I right? This is also Boston Proper, also looks great with the commando. Not just the pants, but think about this with like a leather skirt, which I also have a black leather skirt, but this could look good with um, black jeans. I mean, you can mix and match this with pretty much anything. And this is like a great, a really thin fabric, so you're not gonna get too hot, love. So you guys, I wanted to show you this. Ooh, just move it out, sorry. 
Um, because this is one of the things that Boston Proper does really well. So this is their ribbed um, turtleneck, not turtleneck, well, mock turtleneck, if you will. So if you wanted to, you could zip it all the way up and have that look going for you. Um, I choose to go for the cleavage look. My husband appreciates it too. Um, but it's just, it's such a nice fitted look and it doesn't lose its shape the longer that you wear it. Um, but they have this as well in a non-embellished um, turtleneck. <laughs> I've ordered it. And then they have one that zips all the way down. I've ordered this in light pink. I'm looking in my closet right now. I've got it in light pink, purple, blue, and then I've got it in black. I mean, this is like the best thing to wear with jeans, but as you can see, like I've got it with the commando and it just dresses up and dresses down. It's so comfortable, it's so attractive, it's such a great look. Am I right? All right, you guys, I just chose to leave the mic off for simple purposes. Some of you might have seen yours truly featured in this very hot blazer on the Boston Proper um, Instagram page. I am a huge fan of sexy blazers. Now you could wear this blazer with like a camisole underneath like I have or with absolutely nothing sexy okay but this also comes in red and it is such a statement piece again you could wear this over a dress you could wear this i'm going to show you i've got this with the commando pants on you could wear this with uh, a skirt it is so flexible but it is so beautiful it's so simple dress it up with rhinestones dress it down i freaking love it and i went it out I took it with us when we went to uh, Park City and I got more compliments. I'm taking it with us when we go on Christmas vacation um, and I know I'm gonna get more compliments. In fact, I'm pretty sure we ordered it in red as well because again, it's such a statement piece and something like this, you invest in it and it's gonna just, I mean, this is timeless. This is absolutely timeless. I'm just clearly obsessed. You've gotta get yourself one. So can you guys see how great this looks with leather? You could also wear this, dress it down even further with jeans. Now I've got it with leather in my hot boots. Um, you could wear this with a skirt. You could wear this, think about this, you could wear this black leather skirt, regular skirt, you could wear this over um, a dress. You don't have to wear anything underneath. You could wear something underneath. You could wear this with um, a, a more modest top if you're so inclined. I am not. Talk about a statement piece. I mean, I know I'm a statement by myself, but come on. Hello, hello, hello. I mean, this has you like coming and going. It's so beautiful. And of course, you can, you can leave it open. I kind of like to leave it open, but you can also, it has snaps. Now, I'm okay, here's the deal. I'm on camera, I'm not even gonna try to snap it because I don't have my glasses on and my nails. But you can snap it, it's got snaps. And so think about it, you can have this snapped, you can have it snapped just up here, you can snap it down the front, or you can just leave it open. Um, again, I have this on with these commandos, you could be really casual, you could put this over a dress. It is so sparkly, it is so stunning, and I love it. So this is clearly one of those tops, um, I don't know if you can tell, so the sleeves are kind of transparent. This is one of those tops that can easily be like a day and nighttime top. I can see easily wearing this for like a brunch, but also dressing it up for nighttime. Um, I can see wearing this with white. I've got it with black. I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like with the pants. So see how great this, this looks with black? I'm sure you guys can imagine um, what this would look like. <sighs> I'm trying to think. I would think if I was gonna accessorize this, I would strictly stick with like a white, oh, you know what this would look really good with is like cream. I think this would look good with like ivory pants. Um, that would look really, really good. Like white trousers, cream trousers, or I would go with black. I think it looks really good with black. But again, this could look great during the day and then obviously dress it up, glitz it up for night. Do you not love it? I mean, I'm really loving it. Obviously, my hair has gotten a little crazy in this fashion, this little fashion shoot. See what I do for you guys? Okay, guys, I'm, I'm literally trying to stand on tiptoes because I tried on this dress and I, re <laughs> I realized that I didn't do a full body shot, but um, 
I'm gonna have to do, I'm gonna have to do that in the next video because I gotta wrap this video up. But I hope you enjoyed this little walkthrough tour in my bathroom. This is um, I'm gonna link up all of these. Um, items that I just showed you down below in the comments. But um, this last item that I have on is of course Boston Proper. This is very similar to those, um, the ribbed, uh, I almost said ribbed t-shirts, the ribbed um, long sleeve turtleneck that I showed you, the holiday turtleneck, only this is the sweater dress. So this comes in red and black. Um, very, very comfortable, form fitting, very sexy. Highly recommend it. Um, my hair is just a hot mess right now after doing all of that trying on. Um, but I hope you guys enjoyed this. And like I said, I do plan to do a lot more um, Fashion After 40 um, videos here. So stay tuned for that. And they won't be in my bathroom. They will be in um, a studio setup that I'm creating upstairs. Um, so we'll have a full length mirror. You'll be able to see things better. Um, we'll probably be using some better, um, better equipment or all the equipment that I've bought, I'll put it that way. So I won't be limited by my little microphone here <laughs> that has me tethered to my iPhone. But hey, I am uh, applying the lesson that better imperfect than not. And as you guys know, I have not put up uh, some videos in the past month or so simply because of you know, my dad being in the hospital and then we were uh, gone to Park City for um, Thanksgiving. There was just quite a lot going on and there was just a couple of, you know, me having to make some decisions to take a break here and there. And it's all good because I'm back with a vengeance in 2022 and um, I'm back right now. So there we go. My first ever fashion focused video and I'm excited. It feels so good to feel good in clothes again. I mean, if you would have told me, if you guys would have told me two or three years ago, five years ago, that I would be recording a video and even remotely showing you any part of my body, um, I would have told you no way because you know, for the better part of the past decade, I have been so struggling to get my hormones and weight normalized that I've been hiding. I've been hiding my body for so long and I am, I, I will be weighing myself in the next day or so. And I'm, I should be probably hitting my goal weight. Last time I weighed myself, I was 142. My goal weight's 138. Um, now once I hit 138, I still might let myself lose a little bit more weight. I mean, I'm just kind of continually leaning out and, and I haven't even gotten back on my workout train, you guys. So it's going to be exciting to see what happens when I really do get back into consistent working out. Um, I'll do a whole other video on that to tell you guys what my plan is there. Definitely a different approach. Uh, I definitely plan on a different approach there. Just personal preference. Uh, not that I've been told to do something or that it's necessarily for health, but everything is still going great with keto. I'm still on the keto train. It is definitely a lifestyle. I feel great. I just, it, I'm just, as, I'm just astonished. And I will also link up the latest blog post that I just posted yesterday because you guys, you got to go check out that post. I found a picture that Steve took of me a little over a year ago. It was in November of last year when we were getting married. That was at the height of my estrogen dominance, when my boobs had gone up a size, when I had, got, I had had to go out and buy bigger pants, bigger workout pants. I was just, I had gained fat everywhere. It was, it was on the back of my triceps. It was in my hips and my thighs. And in this picture, it's a full body frontal. And I'm so glad I have that because I just can see it. And I'm like, wow, that so shows how much I had gained in my hips and thighs and just in my middle. And then I, yesterday when I was doing that blog post, I wanted to take a picture of just me now. And you can see, you could see like how much people ask me when I say I've lost 32 inches and 22 pounds, they go, how did you lose like that many inches? Like, well, you can see it because it's like, you just look, it's all around my middle. It was all there. Um, so I'm just so grateful and so happy. And I have 
never felt so great and I just can't wait to help other women do the same. So that said, I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you have any questions about uh, any of the items that I featured, um, I'm happy to answer any of those questions. Um, I know as far as Boston Proper is concerned, they are having a ton of sales. Make sure you sign up for their email list. Um, once you do that, they send text specials all the time, you know, like everybody does, text specials, email specials. Um, I know they've got a lot of stuff going on, so make sure that you sign up. Like I said, I've pretty much purchased the entire catalog um, this uh this holiday season and I love absolutely everything I've got. So hope you guys enjoy. I will see you guys back here in a couple of days. Have a good rest of the day.